So welcome to another product spotlight guys. Today we are going to be using Turtle Wax Bug and Tar Remover. Um, unfortunately my car is in quite a state. Uh, it's a bit shameful to be honest that I've let it get so dirty but it's time to clean it again. And this time though I've managed to accumulate some uh, quite sticky and hard tree sap and resin all over the car. That's what he says it is. Which is, which is a nightmare to be honest. It's horrible stuff so I'm going to give this a go and uh, We'll see how we get on. Okay, so just before I wash it, I have to show you what I mean. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. I've got all this sticky tar. So Lloyd's washing the car and we're at my house. We're in the garage. The garage, which is full of shit. So I can't get my car in here and look at all this shit. Just fucking everywhere. Cleaning shelf and a football sock. Go in there. All my old train sets, hashtag gangster. I was a cool kid as you can tell. Small tools. Yeah. Well, so my car's all been cleaned and dried off, so it's ready for this. Uh, as instructed, it tells you to wash your car first and then to apply the bug spray. Now, I'm hoping this will work. I think it will. Yeah, so I just picked this up at a local store, uh, I'm not going to name any names, but I'm sure you can find this at most auto stores. It's not too uncommon to be honest, Total Wax is quite a big brand. So I'm going to give this a go, I've never used it before, and uh, see what the results are. Okay, so I'm just going to apply, give it a good shake. Right, just apply this to the windscreen. And then on the roof as well, because I part below some trees, and that's where. <laughs> and this is where mo the majority of the uh, sap goes. Now it says to leave it for about a minute or so to do its work, and then you you rub it on the surface with a cloth, and then once that's done, you lightly buff it with a nice soft microfiber, and then that should give you optimal results. So we'll come back in a minute or two. Right, Lloyd's we'll just using this new product. Look, it just looks like spunk. Look, it's like some sort of an orgy on his car. It's like you, Kathy. All over it, man. Not for me, there. I just, no, no. I just don't think, for me, it looks like it could like um, be a bit smeary. Well, we'll see what happens. Let Lloyd finish off his product test. Okay, so I've let the product sit on the car now for a good minute or so. To be honest, I don't quite see how it's meant to do what it's supposed to do, but here we will give it a buff. Just give it a nice little spread. This microfiber. Oh, I can't smear it. Lovely. I really hope this buffs out. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm gonna have to end up using some glass clean. To be honest, I think I'll use some anyway on top of this, just to leave a, a better surface. Ooh. It's like smearing sun cream then on the roof. It's got quite a chemically smell to it. It's not it's not too nice to be honest in terms of odour. <laughs> but again, you know it's it's not it's not a perfume. It's just a cleaning product. So almost finished. To be honest, I think I'll let this sit for it again for a little bit longer. And then uh, we'll give it a nice buff with a fresh microfiber so that I don't continue smearing it. So uh, we'll be back. Okay, I think I've given it a bit more time now, so I should be able to give this a nice buff. Hopefully, it will become less streaky. Let's have a look. So far, it's still a bit streaky, but they are going. Now, in terms of lifting tree sap, no, that's a stone, that's a stone chip. I think that's a bit of bug there, but uh, mm, it's hard to tell really with this if it's worked or not, because I think most of the wash actually lift, managed to lift the bug spray, uh, the bug splat and um, tree sap. But it seems to buff off well, so I'm happy about that. 
Okay, so I finished the buff now. To be honest, I'm, I'm quite pleased with the uh, what it's done. I don't know how well you can see this. But it seems to have buffed it quite well. And it does say it contains a wax finish, so you'd expect it to. So I think it's done quite a good job. Nice and smooth. Less smooth. So overall, I think it's, uh, it's a decent product, but I wouldn't recommend it. It's not really essential. Um, it probably should be better off doing a good wash. Um, so yeah, that is Turtle Wax Bug and Tar Remover. From, well, from Turtle Wax, you probably find it online and in other stores. So yeah, hope you enjoy.